The Dearborn Heights City Libraries present 5 to 10 crafting series with Eileen and Venus. I'm Eileen. And I'm Venus. Crafts are for elementary children, but all ages are welcome. Each month we will be doing a craft video. Crafts will be available for a limited time for pickup at Dearborn Heights City Libraries and when possible as a download on our website. Now, let's get crafting. We are going to do a project for tax day craft. What you're going to need is some construction paper or regular white paper, or you can do find this printout for a limited time on our website, and you can print that off. If you don't, then you can take a round glass or cup and draw circles around it and make the circles, put the numbers in it, and you can draw or cut out in color paper a hat and the face. It's just a nose, a mouth, and we put some googly eyes on it, but you can draw the eyes on as well. We will also need some cotton balls for his beard. And I do have the googly eyes here. So let's get started with our project. So the first thing I'm gonna do is, of course, if you are doing this without the printout, you're gonna make your circles, write your numbers in it, but then we're gonna color each circle. I'm gonna start coloring this one, nice purple color. What is your favorite color? Is it purple? Is it blue? How about green? Or maybe, maybe it's red. I'm staying in the lines, are you? Of course, if you do go out of the lines a little bit, you know what, it's okay. Because when we cut it out, you won't notice it. All right, what's your next color? I think I'm gonna do number two in red. It's a nice, nice bright color. And if you want, you can even make these circles multicolors by coloring part of it one color and picking up a crayon and coloring with a different color. All right, how about a yellow one? I'm gonna do three yellow. Nice and bright. Do you know what color yellow is? It's like the sun, bright yellow. All right, um, blue. I think I'm gonna do four in blue. Now you take your time coloring. You don't have to color it as fast as I am. I've had a lot of practice. And I think, let's see, we've got blue, purple, yellow, red. I think I'll do this one in green, or do I, should I do orange? Hmm, I like orange. I think I'm gonna do it like orange. But you do it in the colors you like. This. Uh oh, see how I went out? That's all right. When I cut it out, you won't know it. Okay, so now we've got all our colors, all our circles colored. How are you coming along with your project, Venus? Hey, Miss Eileen. I'm using things I found around the house. Solo cup, construction paper. I don't have cotton ball. I found something else that stretches and would work for cotton. And I have a couple of different paint pens, marker glue, scissors. I'm going to use the bottom of the red cup as my 
circles. Check back with you later. All right, I've got my scissors and they're nice rounded scissors. If you have adult scissors, maybe you can get mom to, or dad to help you cut out some of these. And you take your time cutting. You got all the time to do this project from at home. Okay, that's number five. Let's cut out my blue four. Purple five, blue four. Oh, oh. All the way around. Let's get my number one here. And there's that mistake there, but I just Cut it right off. You don't even know that I was outside the line. All right, let's keep cutting. How is your project coming along? I'm doing good, Miss Eileen, as you can see. I've got my circles done with the numbers inside. I'm just about to cut them. Back to you. All right, there's one more number and then we need to cut the face and the head out. And on this, you can see a picture of how it's going to look when we're done. This is our little Uncle Sam bookworm. He comes around every April for tax day. All right, now don't forget, if you don't have the googly eyes, you can draw any kind of eyes you want on the face. Let's get the hat. And you, can you draw a hat if you don't have one? This one is red, white, and blue with stripes on. Okay, now we got our hat. Let's get rid of that. Our trash. And we've got all our numbers. So I think I am gonna take and let's find our number one where it is. It, there it is. So we need our glue now. So I'm gonna take my glue. And right along the top here. And I'm gonna glue my face on top of there. There we go. So now we have our number one here. Let's find number two. How good are you counting? I bet you, you can count up to five real easy. All right, there it is, number two on there. Now, is he going to be a straight worm or is he going to kind of squiggle? Uh, you decide. Let's see, where's our number three? That glue on it. And then we're going to put him underneath number two. There he is. He's getting to be nice and tall. Number four. You guys are very good at counting. Put that on there. And what's our last number? Number five. You're right. And put that underneath. Okay. 
now we need to put the hat on. So let's come all the way up top, right on top of his head. There's his hat. Now we need our Uncle Sam's eyes. And I have googly eyes. I have googly eyes and I'm just gonna take some glue. And one eye is gonna go here. Let's find our other eye. There's the other eye. So now we have our eyes on. So the next thing we need to do is we need some cotton balls. So I've got two little cotton balls. I'm gonna kind of stretch them just a little bit. Just both of them. And where's his beard go? Right on the bottom of his chinny chin chin. So there's his glue. Yeah, one goes on that side. And one goes on the other side. And he's got his beard. Let's move it down just a little so we can see his mouth. And if you want, you know what? I think I'm gonna give him a bright red nose. But you decide, maybe you like a pink nose. But there is our Uncle Sam tax day bookworm. I hope you had fun doing this. Venus, did you do one too? Let's see what yours looks like. Yes, Miss Eileen, this is what mine turned out to be. I even gave him cotton eyebrows. And there's my hat. Hope you guys had fun. Back to you, Miss Eileen. All right. I will say bye for now, but don't forget to tune in for our different five to 10 crafting. Enjoyed what you saw here? Subscribe to the Dearborn Heights Library channel on YouTube and be notified when there's a new episode. Did you know that with your Dearborn Heights Library card, you can borrow eBooks, e-audiobooks, stream thousands of hours of music, and even movies. You can download apps for your devices or visit our website on a computer. Last blurb, we promise. Stay connected with us at dhcl.mishlibrary.org and on Instagram, Facebook, and Twitter. Thanks, Thanks for, for tuning in! in.